What's up guys and welcome back to Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare 2 and today while Feast of His Fun might be over the entirety of fun is not because while once again we can't go to the snowman and get Feast of His stuff we can still get it through the Feast of His pack. Feast of His has frozen over, but there's still plenty of fruitcake, plenty of time to complete your set of holiday exclusives. A fantastically festive feast, feast of his pack is now available in the sticker shop for a limited time. Now, we're gonna be doing a spending spree on this today. It is a little bit on the expensive side, but I think the same price as Delana Doom one, which is, of course, if we scroll all the way over to the right, 40,000 coins per pack. So as you can see, we have almost 400,000 coins on the dot, so we'll be opening up at at most 10 packs today, we're gonna be opening them up until you know either we run out of coins or we have all of the Feast of Us items. So with that being said, it took me like all morning to earn up a good chunk of coins to make sure that we could buy a decent amount of them today in today's video. So if you do enjoy the video and you enjoy the spending spree, make sure you let me know in the comment section below and also make sure to give this video a like. But with that being said, I don't want to dilly dally too much with it. If you haven't seen some of the Feast of Us videos, I suggest you do because we've been trying to go to the snowman as much as possible to get you know some of them for free instead of having to do this, but ooh, I like them. So far we get the candy cane shoot, which is of course a bamboo plant pot, but all candy caned out. And then we have the elf pea, which is the normal pea shooter plant pot, but all elf, I like that, that's so cute. We get the zom tree, which I'm guessing is just gonna be a brown coat, but he looks super cool. Definitely an upgrade from the Garden War for one version. The lights look better, I can see some stars on the bottom, and of course the zombot star kind of thing, that's new as well. We got the jingle eyes and the candy canes. Let's go ahead and open up more of them here. And like I said, we'll try to open up at the most 10, probably going to be 10, because it seems like there's way more Feast of Us items than there was Lawn of Doom items. And also, we're also getting, you know, like, repeats at times, too. But we got the Feast of His Weed, which, of course, is a normal, it might actually be a pumpkin weed, I'm not sure, when it comes to, like, its amount of health. But as you can see, it has sort of a broken Christmas uh, ornament on top of its head. Then we got the Bell Breaker Bot, which I think is the Punch Bot. Very cute looking, I like the robotic hat. We got the LP again, we got the Missile Nose, and the Red Present. One th the big thing that concerns me is that we're getting more, you know, plant pots, consumable items, than we are getting customizable. So it might start slowing down more and more, but as long as we get at least two, that's a good progress. The Gifted Boxer Bots, no, that's the Punching Bot. Hmm, I'm not sure what the other one was then, but we got the Gifted Boxer Bot here, we got the Stocking Mustache, and we got the Winter Trees. Oh, that's not too bad. But I like this because it's just presents, and he has he has like an elf hat on that one, but that's pretty cool. All right, then let's open up another one here, and let's see what we're getting here. But I've really enjoyed it. Also, we have been showing off festive edition hats. If you guys don't know, there's a $10 festive edition upgrade, which actually gets you 10 exclusive Feast of His hats that you cannot get in this pack. But you get the snow goggles for the imp. I like those a lot. And the tree beard. That one's okay. There's so much. Like There really is a lot more than the Lawn of Doom. For the Lawn of Doom, there was one per class. But here, as you can see, there is so much stuff. Uh, we got the gingerbread head, we got the popcorn trees, and this is, you know, after five or six videos of going to the snowman and getting stuff done there. So that's just really crazy. But here we got something. Ooh, okay, oh, I like those. We check this out, we got the winter eye mouse, but this is cool. The reindeer specs, because they go good with the reindeer hat. Ah, oh, that's gonna be super cool looking. That would be a nice setup to do. I'll have all these setups I can do for next Feast of Us. <laughs> but who's gonna be in this one? It's gonna be. Okay, then two more items. We got the gingerbread glasses and the holiday tree hat. So we still have a lot more to go. As you can see, we're already more than halfway through. If we do run out of coins, that'll be it for today's video. It'll be short and sweet, but that's still pretty good. Ooh, okay. Not bad, not bad. We got ourselves the bulb head and the big snowflakes. We see a lot of like snow related, you know, tattoos for the zombies. But if we do run out of coins, what I'll probably be doing within the next few episodes is opening up a pack of these whenever I can. But I actually do, I might actually have some character upgrades that I can use to get us a little bit more coins. We'll have to check for that. Uh, played, or plaid gift wrap, not played. And then we got candy teeth. I think I've seen the candy teeth before, which is pretty cool. I'm really looking into the hats, but this is gonna be the last one unless we have more, you know, promotions I can do. We'll find out right here it is. Ooh, okay then, so we got the mistletoe hat, and then we also got the gingerbread glasses. I think I have at least two. Uh, ooh, yeah, that's right. So I've mastered, up, mastered out the commando corn, which means all of my kernel corns are mastered, and then I also mastered this guy over here, 
the torch one. So there you go. Um, a big New Year's resolution for me is trying to get all of the plant and zombie classes mastered. Hopefully it'll happen, we'll have to find out when the year is over, but that's sort of like a small Garden Warfare related resolution. But we got one more bonus pack to get here, and it will be, let's see, let's see, come on, something good? Okay, ooh, I like those, because those will mix well with their already the candy cane wand. So this is the candy cane specs and the mistletoe collar. So we got some cool combos there if we wanna go ahead and check them out. And we'll also put, throw out some of those uh, plant bots and zombie bots just to sort of give a good idea of what they look like. But I wanted to go ahead and put that on there and put this, that is such a cute combo, look at that! <laughs> oh, I love it! That is so cute. Is We don't have any, you know, Feast of Us related uh, tattoos here. And, but I'm sure we could find something that fits. Like that sort of fits. I like the sky with the clouds that we went over. Where were they? That looks so cute. It's colorful. It's really, really adorable. Oh my gosh, I love that. But then, um, what else did I want to see? I wanted to see, nope, that's not what I wanted to do. Let's go back in there. I wanted to see this rose. If we go like this, appearance. And she doesn't have a Christmas hat, but she does have, as you can see, the candy canes there. And that's a cool little candy cane combo. I think that's pretty nice. And then we could add something else here that might fit, even though the, the dark, or not the dark blue, but the you know the icy blue is probably the best fit. But you get what I mean, pretty cool stuff. Let's go ahead and check out the, um, what we'll do it as the Feast of a Sunflower we got going on here. But uh, let's go ahead and check out those plant pots, then we'll move over to the zombies, check out the zombie bots, all that kind of stuff. We'll start a flag of power, that way it's more, you know what, we could actually do it from back here. I don't want to go ahead and start a flag of power if all that's going to happen is they're going to get taken out. So let's go ahead and spawn you in here. So as you can see, there's we actually have a scroll wheel now, which is really interesting. So we got ourselves the elf bee and the candy cane shoot. So this bee shooter makes toys out of zombie bits. Ah, oh, that is so cute. I like how it's like little mittens or little socks or something. So darn cute. I love it. And we got the candy cane shoot over here as well. It looks pretty cool. Oh, oh and it's already firing off. It would be cool if it shot down like candy cane related like stuff. I'm guessing the visuals are for attacking are gonna be exactly the same, so I'm not gonna worry about it too much. I love the glasses. This one, the detail is insane. Like it looks actually crocheted. Very, very cool. I'm blown away by the detail on that one, but let's go ahead and switch to the zombie side really quick and see what we can, nope, that's still a plant. Hold on. All right, so we're on the zombie side and I'm gonna do exactly the same thing. Why am I taunting? Did not press the taunt button. But uh, we're gonna do exactly the same thing. We're gonna run down here and check out the Feast of Us related ones for here. We got the Gifted Boxer Bot and the Bell be Breaker Bot. So this one is Cross Range Melee. Uh, plants are in for a surprise when they discover what's in these gift boxes. So that is pretty darn cool. Ah, so cute. And then of course if we go over here, we can spawn in the other one, which is the Bell Breaker Bot. Uh, armor Breaker and Ding Dong, your armor is gone. <laughs> Oh, so he's like the loudmouth bot, I think. Okay, very, very cool indeed. All right then. <laughs> so that is the Feast of Us pack. Feel free to let me know what kind of cool stuff you have gotten inside, what your favorite Feast of Us item is, and all that kind of stuff. Hopefully I can you know, continue buying those at the end of each episode until we eventually get ourselves some wonderful, wonderful completion status for Feast of Us. But for now, that'll be it. There's more going on War for Two content coming throughout 2017 and other stuff as well. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare 2. If you enjoyed it, make sure you give this video a like, share it with your friends and family, and of course, comment in the comment section below. If you watched this point in the video, make sure you comment Feast of Us Zebra, so I know you've watched it in the video, and that you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. But by the way, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.